Hello and welcome to a uh, new devlog. I realize it's been quite a while since the last one, but I've been busy rewriting uh, the interaction system. So interactions are now handled individually. Prior to this update, you would actually have to grab uh, a weapon by its primary grip to interact with anything else on it, like the magwell, slider, or even its secondary grip position. That's no longer the case. Uh, you can now interact with anything on the item even the secondary grip outright, even if it's dropped or inventoried. Um, there is a simple value for each interaction that'll let it be overridden, even if it's already being interacted with. I, have, I don't have that set on the primary grip just so it's easier to interact with the mag and the handle. Um, so let me try to explain how the highlighting system works the best I can. Each interaction has a collider, and when that collider enters this interaction sphere, it's added to a list. Um, and that and it just gets the closest interaction to this uh, point out of that list, and that's what's highlighted, and that's what you'll interact with the next time you give it input. Uh, that wasn't giving me the results I wanted, so I added another value to each uh, interaction called a priority. Um, and now whatever gets highlighted is actually the interaction that uh, priority divided by distance is uh, the greatest. Um, and that means if an item has a low priority, you'll have to be much closer to it um, if there is a high priority interaction also in the interaction sphere. So say this flippable site is a lower uh, priority than this attachment site. So I would have to get much closer to this for my um, hand highlight uh, the flippable site than I would the attachable site. And that just, it makes it really easy to tweak even on a personal level uh, interactions very quickly. Um, a quick inventory change is you can now swap items very easily. And pretty much every weapon has had minor tweaks and improvements. Um, but it, there's quite a bit uh, more noticeable change to the handgun. So now you can toggle the slide stop uh, by clicking left on the touchpad, and that'll just keep the slide back, or you can toggle it again and it'll release it forward. Um, yeah, it, it works great. If there's uh, a loaded mag and you pull back, it'll go forward or empty them on, but you can set it either way. I think that'll do it.